I think we're live. We are live, everyone. Hello. Let's do a live stream. It's Friday evening, 5.46 p.m. here in Colorado. Let me plug in my laptop here, my Chromebook. How is everyone? How's my hair looking? Oof. I've got my trusty Walsenberg hoodie on. I love I love this hoodie. I wear this all the time. <laughs> and the theme for today's live stream is just coffee talk. I got this chili pepper mug. See, it's got chili peppers on it. Red chili peppers. It's kind of a glare. I'm trying to get rid of that glare. Hey to the four people watching. Hey, Melstorm. Hey, David. David, you were the first in chat. You get credit. Yes. I got the chili peppers here. Got a little bit of coffee in here. See the, you see the, I'll show you the coffee here. There's my coffee. <laughs> Sam the King, Melstorm, David, how is everyone? <laughs> Five people watching. Last. It was Tuesday night, three nights ago. I did a live stream on my birthday. I had 26 people at one point. It was unbelievable. 26. Yeah. Sam the King, is it your birthday today? Anyway, here I made a video. I just want to show you this. This was fun. I made a video of me going crazy. When I got to 26, uh, 26 people watching at once. Here it is. All right, and then I'll make the video for you because I do. Oh my gosh, 26 people are watching. Holy crap. Yes, 26, 26. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, everybody. <laughs> How is everyone? This is just a Friday, Friday evening coffee talk with my... Chili pepper, that, that glare is really bothering me. There it is. It doesn't matter what, wait, come on. I'm trying to get rid of the glare. You can see it. <laughs> wait, maybe this way. That's a little better. Chili peppers. I think this was made in Mexico. Made in Mexico, yes. So, <laughs> how is everyone? I've made, today I made, uh, let's see how many not too shabbies I did today. I did, I made two not too shabbies today. And uh, sorry, I'm still like, my hair is like, I got issues with my hair. I'm seeing my, uh, my hairstylist, hairdresser in Buena Vista tomorrow, Shannon. I'm looking forward. Anyway. Today I made two not too shabby videos, and here they are. Okay, it's a leaf rake. Not too shabby. That was Dwight's leaf rake, and then Dwight is—he's got an art project outside his house, and he's—he's—he's he's got a rock design, and it's well. I made a video expressing what I thought of it. It's a yin and yang rock design. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Oh, that reminds me. I have a spooky tinsel ghost right here. What do you think, everybody? <laughs> I'm going to hook it to my curtain here. I got. <laughs> I'm going to put it right here. I gotta find a. I gotta get a safety pin or something to get it on there. But I'm gonna put the ghost somewhere up there. <laughs> I got. It was only one dollar. We have a family dollar uh, store in our town, and this was one dollar. And it's just a little ghost, a tinsel ghost. One dollar. How could you go wrong? I bought one of those Starbucks Frappuccinos, and it was $2.85. 
And I thought, well, if I'm going to buy that, how could I not buy this for an extra dollar? So I, I think I'm going to do a not too shabby of this. This uh, I'm going to do a not too shabby. So, but I'm going to do it in just a little while to keep the suspense because you know I'm such a celebrity, not too shabby video maker. And uh, do 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 do. He's a happy ghost, at least. Is it a he or a she? Or are ghosts unisex? They're neither or whatever, you know? Ha ha ha! It's a ghost! Look at the back. It's just like a little plastic thing. It's really pl it's plastic and a little tinsel. It's a great. So we're going to do it. I'm going to do it not too shabby before this live stream ends. So... David, Sam the King, how's everyone doing? How's everyone doing? My hair. <laughs> you know, I'm telling you, the problem here, I'm going to take a picture. I'll explain why I'm always self-conscious. Because when I do these live streams, I am looking right at my face. This is what I see. I see the chat area on the right. I see everyone chatting on the right. And then I got a big rectangular screen that shows what you see. So I'm constantly looking at my face. All right. So that's why I'm, I'm sort of always looking at my hair or noticing the wrinkles on my face. And so, hey, Hans. Hans, how are you? What time is it in Germany? Actually, let me ask Siri. What time is it in Germany right now? In Berlin, Germany. It's 1.53 a.m. 1.53 a.m.? Oh, my gosh. That is late. It's only 5.53 here. Sam the King, where are you going on vacation? I'll tell you something. You European followers... You, I, I so love you because I know you make that sacrifice of staying up and, you know, not sleeping so that you can attend my live stream here in beautiful Colorado. And look, I got my Colorado hoodie on where it says Walsenburg. See the mountains there? Very nice. Oh, wow. Sam the King, you're visiting Spain. That's something. Wow, not too shabby. Wow, 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 wow. I'm going to invite a couple of people. Jeff, I am live streaming right now. Join us, question mark, smiley face. And then Southpaw. Southpaw, comma, I am live streaming right now. Join us, question mark, smiley face. Really, there's more Europeans right now in my live stream, in my live chat. There's six people. I got two British people. I got a German, Hans. Um, Vary, you aren't, are, are you're in the UK as well, right? Then we got David. David's in, is in, in Illinois. So, all right. If you're just checking in, if you're just checking into my live stream, just you can always say hi. Give me your location. Tell me your favorite not too shabby video. Let's do it. Let's do it. I could even do a not too shabby of my mug. We'll see. We'll see. Ooh, that is pretty, isn't it? That is really pretty. Oh. This isn't going to be an exciting live stream. It's not going to be that exciting. I'm only going to go for about 30, 40 minutes. I'm just shooting for that. All right. Maybe an hour. We'll see how things go. But yeah, yeah. Hey, perfect for tea for sure. Perfect if you're in New Mexico and you love, you know, chili peppers. My heart is in New Mexico. That's for sure. Chili peppers. Oh my gosh. It's so good. So By the way, let me show you something. My aspen tree has yellow leaves on it. The leaves are starting to turn yellow. See? 
See that? Maybe like that. Okay, there. It's a little better. My aspen has some yellow leaves. Let me see if I got any more pictures here. It's very exciting. It's fall. Where did... Come on. Come on, phone. The loud not too shabbies, huh? I have pictures. Did I delete them already? Hey, here's a nice picture. There are these like yellow weedy, they're cut, they're flowers, but they're kind of weedy and they're, they're all over the place here in town. That's a picture like a quarter of a mile from where I live. Got the mountains and those yellow flowers. Isn't that something? So, <laughs> I had other pictures. Oh, wait, I'll go on Facebook. <laughs> I want to show you this. My phone's being dumb. Come on. <laughs> I get annoyed so easily. Here, there's a couple of pictures. So I got an aspen tree. You can see the cactuses. And then there's a couple of shots of yellow leaves. So it's starting. It's starting. David, do I have a car? I can answer that in a very special way here. I'll answer that. Uh, do I have a car? Well, I'll play this. Driving my car. With my engine light on. Not too shabby. Does that answer your question about whether I have a car? Hey, Convoy. Hey, Jeremy. Convoy, I had a good birthday. I had a good birthday. Thank you. I turned 49 years old. I'm 49. This is crazy, man. There's nothing you can do about it. You just get old. You know, <laughs> you just got to enjoy your youth. 49. So maybe someday if I get old, I'll look back and think I was young at age 49. But for right now, I feel old. <laughs> yeah, your dad is 53. Yeah. Jeremy, how are you doing? What are you doing these days? What are you up to these days? This really is just a coffee talk. I don't have much to do. I did buy this as a prop. This $1 tinsel ghost. And I'm going to do a not too shabby pretty soon. Eight people watching. Hello to all eight people watching. Hello. And hello from the tinsel ghost right here. Yeah, you're just biking around town? Convoy, what's your favorite not too shabby? That's what I want to know. Don't ask me. By the way, uh, David asked if I have a car. And I have so many not too shabbies about my car. Like this was just, uh, what, a week, week and a half ago? Here. It's a lot of snow covering my car. Not too shabby. Yeah, not too shabby. Oh, here's another one. This is kind of crazy. It's a lot of garbage inside my car. Not too shabby. We have nine people watching. Hello to everybody. Thank you for watching. I'm just playing my not too shabbies. Here's more car related not too shabbies. Here's another one. I was inside my car. It's my car in a car wash. Not too shabby. Hey, George. Hey, George Jones. Convoy, have I ever thought about doing a spinoff where things are shabby? That would be interesting, but I've never, I don't know. I had never really thought too much about it. So, <laughs> here, I got more car-related not-too-shabbies. Like, uh, I'll do ones where it's my car. Here, ooh. Having 250,000 miles, 
on my car. Not too shabby. Two hundred fifty thousand. That's nothing. I'm up to two hundred sixty-nine thousand miles on my Honda Civic. Two hundred sixty-nine. So, hey, here's another one. Hail hitting my car. My car is getting pummeled by hail, and this is what I thought of it. It's droplets of hail hitting my car. Not too shabby. <laughs> oh, you guys. So many car not too shabbies. <laughs> Here's one. Drive it. Actually, this is kind of a fun. This one, I want to just. I haven't watched this in a long time. Driving at night, not too shabby. Driving at nighttime in Custer County. Not too shabby. <laughs> you can't even see me. <laughs> yeah, that was. Oh, how driving with Mexican music. Here's that. Driving with Mexican music playing. Not too shabby. That's a great one. That is a great one. That Mexican music one. Yeah. Maelstrom, you like my eating not too shabbies? Yeah. <laughs> I always I do have a cheeky grin with a lot of my not too shabbies. Because I take a bite out, bite out of it. And I gotta, you know, say the not too shabby, and there's still food in my mouth. And I have to have oxygen so I can, you know, say the words, the phrase. So you're right. The eating not too shabbies. Red chair, not too shabby. Hey, special K man. Hey, did you? <laughs> All right, let's play the red chair. Where's the red chair? Actually, the red chair is right behind that curtain. You want to see the red chair? <laughs> no, sorry, it's boring. But red chair, not too shabby. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Red chair, not too shabby. <laughs> Red chair, not too shabby. All right, let, let me play that at 25%. 25% playback spe speed. It's still pretty quick. Red chair, not too shabby. Ha 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 ha. One more time. Red chair, not too shabby. Ha ha ha. A not too shabby, not too shabby. Yeah. <laughs> Man, I got so many not too shabbies. It's a little crazy. Here's one. I don't even remember how I... Here, carne asada quesadilla. It's a carne asada quesadilla. Not too shabby. <laughs> that was a good carne asada burrito. I mean, anything with carne asada is good. So, oh, here's a fun one: a hike in an old railroad tunnel. When was this? In Arizona? I don't know. Hike in here. Hiking in an old railroad tunnel. Not too shabby. <laughs> Ha ha! I think that was. Oh wait, that was in Swiss Mail. What the heck? Hike an old railroad tunnel in Swiss Mail, but not. It didn't look like that, did it? Anyway, here's the here is anyway. Hiking in an old railroad tunnel. Not too shabby. <laughs> Oh, you guys. You got to give me a break here because uh, I worked all day today, so I'm a little tired. And Tinsel, Tinsel the ghost, he'll, he'll, he'll talk to you. He'll entertain you. <laughs> 
I got to do it not too shabby of this. <laughs> oh, I just got to rest. Let me see what other not too shabbies I got. I got a lot of good ones. Uh, Stallion Candy Cigarettes. Here. It's Stallion Candy Cigarettes. Not too shabby. <laughs> oh, by the way, I put a link. All right, I'm just going to do this once. I put a link beneath the title to my, uh, an Amazon link to my book, Andre Triumph and Sky, A Bike Across America Story. Go read it. Go read the introduction. Go op read the virtual pages. Read the reviews, good and bad. And you can buy it by print or Kindle format. And I'm actually excited because this is a story. This is, I, I wrote this uh, book six years ago now. It's been published for almost six years now. And uh, it tells the story of my first bike across America trip. So I'm pretty, yeah. And it sold a whole bunch of books. Hey, Jordan. I'm actually excited because I think I've come up with an idea for a second book. I'm not sharing the details yet. But I got to think about it. I got to talk to some people I respect and admire. I think I have a book idea that I might want to write a second book and I've got a good idea. So the only thing is I'm just kind of lazy. I don't know that I want to write another book. But if it's a book, if it, if it, if it becomes a book that I have to write, it becomes one of those things where it's like, oh, no, I have to write it. Then, you know, then I guess I have to write it. We'll see, though. I got an, I got an idea. There was a woman. I won't say her name. She was kind of an acquaintance online. She read some of some things on on about me. She kind of she looked at one of my Bike Across America journals. I'll actually share it here. She read my 2011 Bike Across America journal. Bike and not here. I just shared a, a address, bikeacrossamerica.net. Anyway, we were not really friends, but she just, you know, but she emailed me and she said, I had this dream. It was like, I don't know, I, I can't, I'm not even describing it well, but she said, You were in my dream, and it was like this really profound strong dream that you were going to write a second book and she couldn't even get it out of her head it was kind of crazy for her to because she didn't know me that well and she wrote me the next day and she was like it really just felt like I had to tell you and I couldn't get it out of my mind you know so she wrote me and that was like three months ago, two or three months ago. And uh, today, I don't know, you know, it's one of those things where it's just an idea today. So we'll see what it's like in a few days or a week, sleep on it, all that kind of stuff. But I think I've got a good idea for a book. So we'll see what happens. And I know this is maybe a little boring, but... <laughs> Hey, it's, it's coffee talk. Coffee with a red chili pepper mug. So we'll see what happens about the book idea. All right, it's time to do a not too shabby of this ghost. All right, let's do it. Let me put this, oh, maybe over here. Get some light on in here. All right, and then... Where's my camera? You're lucky. You're going to witness a not too shabby. Okay, let me just see. Oh, 
Okay, okay, here we go, here we go. It's a tinsel. It's a ghost decoration. Yeah, all right, here we go. Made out of tinsel. It's a ghost. It's a ghost decoration. It's a ghost decoration made out of tinsel. Not too shabby! I think I got it. I got it. I almost twisted my back doing that not too shabby. Ha, ha, ha. All right, let's see how that came out. Ha, ha. Here we go. I think, I think it came out pretty good. It's ghost decoration made out of tinsel. Ha 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 ha! One more time. It's a ghost decoration made out of tinsel. Not too shabby! Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Ha ha ha! So there you go, ghost. There you go, ghost. One dollar. I bought it for one dollar at the family dollar. So I'm really happy. What what can you get for a dollar these days? And especially like for it's like a not too shabby video idea. So there you go. We've gone for 26 minutes. I'm gonna go till the 40 minute mark. I'm going for 14 more minutes. So special K man, where are you located and how did you find me? I'm just curious. What's your favorite not too shabby? I'll play it for you and I'll tell you the backstory. I now have 1,961 uh, not too shabbies. 1,961 not too shabbies. Isn't that amazing? And also, here is the most watched. I have all my playlists based on most views, you know, most popular in the Los Animas County Courthouse, not too shabby. That was uh, promoted on Reddit is number one. It's the Los Animas County Courthouse. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. A jalapeno oh. bagel. Not too shabby. Special, here's the Funhouse one. It's this Funhouse guy saying I'm an internet comedian. Uh, there's a gentleman, uh, an internet comedian? Not too shabby. Ha ha ha. Lawrence called me an internet comedian. Hey, Sam the King, thank you for the $2 super chat. Thank you, Sam the King. All right, Special K. First of all, thank you again, Sam the King. I appreciate the two two pounds. Not even just two dollars, but two pounds. So I really do appreciate that. That's very nice of you. All right, Special K. Your favorite not too shabby is the Southern Arizona Guidebook. Oh, that's... Where is that? Hold on. I think I got that. Where's the Southern Arizona? Wait, it's over here. I'm going to get it. I got it right here. The Southern Arizona Guidebook. It's a little vacation guide. Magazine. Discover Southern Arizona. Nogales, Rio Rico, Tubac, Green Valley, Sabarita. It's very nice. All right, so... The backstory. Let's first of all let's play it. Southern Arizona, not too shabby. Wait, not too shabby. All right, so here it is. You really like this one? Let's just play it for. Let's. All right, I'll play it. It's a Southern Arizona vacation guide. Not too shabby. Ha <laughs> ha! I squeak. <laughs> All right, let's play that one again. It's a Southern Arizona vacation guide. Not too shabby! 
<laughs> That's been watched 108 times. It was published on January 20, 2020. So, um, the story is, I just had it. I had this, I was at, I was staying in Saurita, Arizona. It's kind of, it's sort of south of Tucson by 10, 15 miles. And I had this vacation guide and I didn't want to do the not too shabby in my hotel room. So I thought, okay, I'll do it in the car. Cause you, you don't want to be screaming in a hotel room. It just doesn't, there's lots of issues with that. But uh, so I did it in the car. And I'll tell you something. Uh, I'll tell you why <laughs> I don't do not too shabbies in hotel rooms much. Uh, let's see here. Because I got a story to tell you. I once made a not too shabby video of my friend Val Kaskovic. There she is. See her? Very lovely young woman. And uh, I, was, I, I needed to do a not too shabby of her. And so, <laughs> and I was going to do a not too shabby of her picture. So I was at a Red Roof Inn in Tucson and I did the not too shabby. Here it is. It's a photo of Val Kaskovic, the CEO of College Planner Pro. Not too shabby. All right. Not too shabby. Notice how loud I was. I said, not too shabby. It's a photo of Val Kaskovic, the CEO of College Planner Pro. Not too shabby. Well, within with a few minutes after I did that not too shabby, my uh, red the Red Roof Inn phone rang. And the woman at the front desk said, there was a report of a of noise in your room <laughs> and i was like oh my gosh i'm so sorry you know all i did was a not too shabby and you know she was forgiving but i learned okay don't be really loud in a hotel room like try to you know what i mean so so let's just play that one more time it's a photo of val keskovic it's a photo of val keskovic the ceo of college planner pro not too shabby. And go check out, go check out College Planner Pro. All right, go check it out. It's some kind of website app to help you with all of your college planning needs. So, so anyway, yeah. So there's a story. See, there's a backstory to the Southern Arizona Planner, and then it led to this live stream of of Val. How about that, ladies and gentlemen? These stories are just riveting. Just unbelievable. <laughs> Look at that red chili pepper mug. I should do a not too shabby of this mug. <laughs> should I <laughs> should I do a not too shabby of this mug? All right, let's just do it. Let's just do it. I'm gonna do it really fast. All right, let me get the background a little better. Here, I'll put you on top of this. <laughs> oh, actually, I, that looks good. Okay. <laughs> this is too much of a glare. This glare is annoying the crap out of me. Hold on. Okay. <laughs> now it's darker in here, but there's no glare. I got all this junk in the background. The ghost. <laughs> Okay. It's a chili pepper mug. Not too shabby. I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I, I'm going to do a second take, I think. Let's see. It's a chili pepper mug. Not too shabby. I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do a second take. I'm just not. I didn't feel good about that one. Okay. I like the delivery though. It's a chili pepper mug. Not too shabby. 
All right, I like that one. All right, what do you think of this one? It's a chili pepper mug. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah, that's it. That's it. Yes, I got it. All right, let me get the light back in here. You know, I'm not very good at many things in life. But there's no question, I am the greatest not too shabby video maker. I have no peer. I'm the greatest. I am the greatest in uh, in human history at making these not too shabby videos. I'm, I'm, yeah. I need to sell my autograph or something and then put not too shabby underneath it or something. <laughs> I should start selling. You know, I should start like with the ghost. I could start doing a, a thing where I do a not too shabby. I, I put, I upload the video and then on the item, I sign my name and I say not too shabby. Wouldn't that be amazing? Would, I, maybe I could make money doing that. Wouldn't that be a good thing? Ha ha ha. Hey Sam, your cat just ate a giant moth. Wow. 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 Special K, do you have any other favorite not too shabby videos? Come on, you picked a great one. You picked a great one. And it was kind of like a different one. A different one. And I still have this because I'm headed back to southern Arizona later this year. So ha ha ha. Sam the King, did you get a video of your cat eating a moth? Ha ha ha! What's the name of your cat? Hello to all 11 people. Please check in. You can just type hi and hit enter. Give me your location. Tell me your favorite not too shabby video. Just give me your favorite not too shabby. You know? Yeah. So. <laughs> hey, so three days ago I turned 49. And here's that not too shabby. It's my 49th birthday. Not too shabby! Ha 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 ha! Ha ha ha! Oh man! You guys. I'm gonna go. I'm really go, only gonna go for another 10 minutes. I just gotta. I gotta be a little more moderate and uh, take care of my myself here. So. <laughs> My coffee is really cold. The, what's remaining? It's just awful. Should I drink it? I hate cold coffee, but... Now I'll wash it down with some cherry vanilla. This is the Walmart bread. Cherry vanilla flavored sparkling water. Hey, Fantasy Snipes! Um, fantasy, no. <clears throat> I really don't have a view of the mountains that I can show you. And if I walk out, like, out of my house, then the Wi-Fi, it'll, it'll cut off. Because, uh, so I'm sorry. But, I mean, I did take a picture. Let's see here. Um, Trying to find pictures. Here was a picture a few days ago. Look at those big mountains. Oh my gosh, look at those big mountains. That's something, isn't it? Pretty nice. <laughs> oh, I was at Cottonwood Pass. This was on Tuesday. Look at all the snow up there. I got the snow in the foreground and that mountain in, in the uh, background. Isn't that something? Special K, the ravioli not too shabby. Re Special K, that's funny you mentioned that one because uh, the ra when people ask me what my favorite not too shabby is, out of 1,961, I usually say the ravioli one, believe it or not. It's my, it's my favorite. And here it is. 
<laughs> Here. It's a three-pound bag of cheese raviolis. Not too shabby! <laughs> I gotta do my next not too shabby. I'm gonna be I'm gonna I'm gonna do it as close to that where I'm kind of screaming it, but <laughs> You guys. Oh. oh, I know what. I'm going to put the cherry vanilla drink in my mug. So at least it appears like I'm sipping coffee. I call this coffee talk, or what did I call it? Coffee. Coffee with whatever. Coffee in a chili mug, I think. That's pretty boring. I think because it was my 49th birthday, more people were coming in. I got up to 26 people and um, people were like all these strangers were coming in and I, I retained a bunch of them. So, and I think it was because I called it my birthday and I thought about it. I could do a live stream. If I really wanted to just get the most viewers, the best live stream I could do is I could just moderate and just say, what do you think about Donald Trump? And I'll just moderate. I'll seriously just let everybody just comment in the chat section. Good, bad, whatever. And I'll just be as objective as I can. I'm definitely truth-based. So because Trump's such a liar, you know, he, you know, I'm, I would seem biased to him. But obviously I'm committed to truth. Um, but anyway, that would be kind of cool. But I, I wouldn't do that because I don't want to over politicize things you know it's 2020 i'm not going to be silent but yeah but I, I see how now you could do a live stream and if you have a provocative post you know everybody wants to talk about marijuana cannabis everyone wants to talk about that i could do a live stream but you know that's not my thing so <laughs> hans have a good night take care from germany Take care. Take care of yourself, Hans. Sleep well. <laughs> the toy snake is a great one. All right, but all right. I always play the toy snake one. Somebody give me a different not too shabby. Give me a rare not too shabby that you like. Is there do you got a rare one? Everyone wants to see the toy snake one. You know, what do you think? Ooh, how about an immaculate bathroom? It's an immaculate bathroom. Not too shabby. Ha, 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 ha. That was at Serendipity Coffee Shop in Wals Walsenburg. That's at the coffee shop in Walsenburg, Serendipity. Ha, ha, ha. I just want to play rare, not too shabbies. <laughs> trying to find. Uh, bike. Oh, how about biking past an abandoned school? Not too shabby. I'm biking past an abandoned school. Not too shabby. <laughs> what do you think about that? <laughs> oh, you guys. Oh, a plate of nachos. This is a rare. I, I, I totally forgot this one. A plate of nachos. It says three years ago. Let's play this one. It's a large plate of nachos. Oh, my buddy Bill. Not too shabby. There's Bill. <laughs> oh. David, I have a TV. Here, let me see if I got a not too shabby of my TV. I hardly turn on my TV. That's my issue. Oh, wait. <laughs> Nacho chabby, shabby. Guys, I'm, I, I think pretty soon I'm going to end this live stream.
Snow in September. All right, I'll play that for you, Special K. So, snow in September. Yeah, you bet. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I got... Do you know I have two snow in September, not too shabbies? One was last week. Here it is. It is snowing on September 8th. Not too shabby. All right, so there's that. There's also another from five years ago. Here it is. I, I haven't watched this in a long time. It's snow on the last day of September. Not too shabby. Oh, my gosh. Snow on September 30th. Now, that's not as exciting as snow on September 8th. So, oh, wait. A 10-mile-an-hour speed limit sign buried in snow. Here it is. It's a 10-mile-an-hour sign almost buried in snow. Not too shabby. Oh, my gosh. Isn't that crazy? Oh, my gosh. Hey, Walt P. Hey, Special K, the uh, Sombrero Lamp. Hello, Exploring. How are you doing? Sombrero Lamp. That was uh, at a Mexican restaurant. At a Mexican restaurant in Tucson, Arizona. And I knew I couldn't be that loud. I had to do a not too shabby. And I said, all right, I can't be too loud, but I'm not going to be too. I just have to be in the middle and just do it. It's a sombrero, but it's also a lamp. Not too shabby. <laughs> oh, hey, Travis. Travis, how are you? Exploring, I'm going to be in Buena Vista tomorrow. I'm headed to Buena Vista. So, no matter what, we'll see what the, uh, you know, the the, uh, the 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 air quality, smoke, all that stuff. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I might drive up Cottonwood Pass. I mean, I want to hike, but I don't really want to hike with if the if it's kind of smoky. We'll see, but I'm just going to at least drive up there and, you know, you can't really go wrong with photography and all that stuff. So, Travis, I'm doing well. I have made two, uh, all right, I made two not too shabbies that have already been uploaded. And then during this live stream, I've made two not too shabbies. First, I have this ghost. I bought it at the Family Dollar for only $1 this afternoon. Here's the not too shabby. Okay. It's a ghost decoration made out of tinsel. Not too shabby. Ha <laughs> ha And then the chili pepper mug. This is the theme. My chili pepper mug made that's made in Mexico. And here's that not too shabby. It's a chili pepper mug. Not too Ha 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 ha! Oh, Walt P. The butternut squash, not too shabby. That's a great one. Butternut squash. I know what you're talking about. The chips. Butternut squash, not too shabby. All right. So this butternut squash tortilla chips. This is at my friend Katrina's house, and well, I think she let me eat. Some of the chips, and I liked it so much that I made this video. It's butternut squash tortilla chips. Not too shabby. <laughs> Isn't that something? Oh, look, there's another butternut squash, but just a plain old butternut squash. <laughs> Here's that not too shabby. It's a butternut squash. Not too shabby. <laughs> so I got two butternut squash. And that, you know, there's not much of a story. I was just over John and Barb's house. 
So isn't this something? All these not too shabbies. With the two that I need to still upload that I just played, I'm up to 1,963 not too shabby videos. Wow. What, what Just incredible. Isn't that incredible, ladies and gentlemen? Just amazing. So... <laughs> Fall related. I got to do something fall related. The, the the leaves are starting to change just a little bit. So maybe if I can find a cluster of trees, I may go drive in tomorrow. I may just go drive in. I may hit Twin Lakes. I might go up to Leadville. I might go up to Leadville tomorrow. You know what? Let me just uh, text my friend real fast. Well, okay. I don't want to commit. I've got a friend in Leadville, but I don't want to say, we'll see. We'll see. I'm one of those guys. I, I, I'm i not a commitment phobe, but there are times where on days off, I'm just spontaneous. I don't want to be locked in too much, you know? So, oh, exploring. You like the Wellsville Arch video. Exploring. Have you been to the Wellsville Arch? I'm just curious. Just curious. Anyway, here, um, here is the Wellsville Arch Not Too Shabby. I think it's a good one. It's the Wellsville Arch. Not Too Shabby. Yeah, you see it every day. You know what? Exploring. It's one of those things, that arch is one of those things where if you're not looking for it, you'll never really see it. You won't, you, most people won't notice it ever. You know, maybe, I don't know how many, but 95% of all people, they'll just drive sort of near it and they won't even look up or see it. You know what I mean? And uh, it's kind of a unique thing. So... Yeah, Travis, I love going for drives in the country. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, my gosh, guys, I'm getting tired. I'm getting tired. I've gone for 52 minutes and uh, 35 seconds. <sighs> I got my ghost. <laughs> I got to, I'm going to, I need to find, I, I got to get it like a safety pin or something. I'm going to hang it on my curtain here. You know, I'm going to have like a, maybe like a seasonal thing. I got to start decorating these curtains. All right. They're just boring curtains right here. So what do you think? So, oh, uh, oh, exploring. You're still at work. You're still at work, yeah? Exploring, I saw three places where you might be living in, in Wellsville. <laughs> I was like, I see three places where it appears that somebody is living there. So I was like, he lives in one of those three places. So, <laughs> Walt P., the Michigan cutting board. I'll give you the backstory on that. Michigan cutting board, not too shabby. Well, I was over at my friend Ethan's house. Ethan in Colorado Springs. We went on a hike that morning. We got back to his house. And, yeah, he's from Michigan. You know, and he had a Michigan pillow. It's a Michigan pillow. Not too shabby. And then, in his kitchen, he had this cutting board right in the kitchen. It was beautiful. It's a Michigan cutting board. Not too shabby. There you go, the Michigan cutting board. I saw it, and I said, Ethan, I got to do a not too shabby. And he felt honored, you know. So to my Michigan, you know, my Michigan uh, friends. And followers right there, Michigan. Isn't that something? 
<laughs> oh, you guys. <laughs> yeah, Michigan. There you go. I got my. <laughs> I'm so I'm getting tired, guys. I'm getting tired. I'm gonna, I'm trying to hang in there. I'm gonna go for another five minutes. I'm just trying to let me find some boring, not too shabbies. Uh, how about a Colorado heart magnet? It's a Colorado heart magnet. Not too shabby. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's a good one. Woo! I'm tired. <laughs> in uh, where I live, I live in a small little rural mountain town. And some people have horses, mostly the Amish. The Amish, there's an Amish population in my county, Custer County. So there's some horse and buggies. You can hear them go by or it's really neat to hear a horse and buggy. You can hear the horse going clop, 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 you know, going down the street kind of a thing sometimes. And it just feels so, you know, it feels like you're in the 1700s or something, you know. But uh, anyway, so they have signs that say no vehicles or horses here. It's a sign prohibiting vehicles or horses. Not too shabby. So some of the signs here. Wait, I'll find some. Uh, Let's see. I'll just do horse, not too shabby. Yeah, yeah, like here's a horse and buggy sign. It's a horse and buggy sign. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Yeah, exploring. There's a lot more people in uh, Wellsville than you think. I believe you. I believe you on that. Uh there you go. I want to do a not too shabby, but of the Amish, but the Amish don't like being photographed or video. You just want to be respectful of that's not their thing. And occasionally I've snuck a little video or something, but I don't want to be like right in their face, you know, here horse and buggy parking. This is at the Custer County court at the courthouse, the County courthouse. Here in Westcliff. And it's here's what it says. It's the parking area for horse and buggies. Not too shabby. Is that amazing? How about that? How about that? Yeah, Travis. Travis, I played that earlier. The Funhouse calling me an internet comedian. I'll play that again. I'll play it again. Here we go. Here it is. It's this fun house guy saying I'm an internet comedian. There's a gentleman, uh, an internet comedian? Not too shabby. <laughs> Lawrence. I call him the internet guy. His name's Lawrence. So, <laughs> so the dangerous rock sign. Walt Tripp, you're, you've got some great suggestions here. Dangerous rock uh shabby let's see here wait i typed it wrong shabby wait i typed dangerous wrong da dangerous rock not too sh okay uh, i can't find it rock sign i'm just gonna do okay wait rock I want to find that one because that's a good one. Rock sign, shabby. I'm going to, okay, I'm going to find it. Here it is, dangerous rock sign. <laughs> Here we go. It's a dangerous rock sign. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Comedian, artist, athlete. Oh, man. Exploring. Take care of yourself. Thanks for stopping by. 
be well this evening. Get your work done. Don't work too hard. Let's hope this smoke clears out this weekend. You know, have fun over there in Wellsville. All right. I'm 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 getting to the point where I'm I'm getting tired here. <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna cut it pretty soon here. <laughs> oh, here's Jessica's pet grooming. Here's a really fast one. It's Jessica's pet grooming, not too shabby. <laughs> oh, you guys. Yeah, I'm going to wrap it up, man. I'm sorry. To all everyone watching, it's time. Have a good night. From my kitchen, where the chili pepper mug has been the theme. My book is a sponsor. There's a link below the title. And my tinsel ghost. This has been the wild card. The great entertainer. You know, this has been a good one. So, and then the South, Southern Arizona discovery. <laughs> we had some fun. I'm sorry. I'm cutting it short. I got, I got to sleep, man. I got to, I, I just know it's time. All right. Take care. It's a dangerous. Wait. <laughs> dangerous rock sign. Not too shabby. That just started playing. I just touched the screen. I'll play one last not too shabby video. Uh, how about a wrong way sign? I love those wrong way signs. Here we go. It's a wrong way sign. Not too shabby. Oh, yeah. All right. Goodbye, everybody. Sam the King, Travis, David, Wall trip. Anyone else exploring? I think you're gone already. And anybody else? Uh, the other guy in Michigan. Special K. All right. Hans. I had some Europeans in here. Take care. Make it a good night. And remember, it's always a little better when it's in a red chili mug. Red chili pepper mug. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>